Hello, hello folks. In this episode of One Paper, One Minute, I'll be using our recent paper about argon-argon dating best practices to do a crash course on argon dating. This technique is based on the decay of potassium-40 into argon-40. And the good news is that potassium is present in pretty much every mineral. Not only in obvious potassium-rich ones like sanidine or mica, but also in minerals like plagioclase and even pyroxene. One of her first tasks is to use a binocular microscope to unpick pure alteration-free and inclusion-free material for optimum results. You know what they say, rubbish in, rubbish out. We then send the sample to neutron activation in a nuclear reactor to convert part of the potassium in 39 argon. After that, we analyze the sample using a laser and a normal gas mass spectrometer. We plot the result as H spectra or isochrones that allow checking if we can calculate an H or not. If we can get an H, then that's where the science and fun truly begins. See you next time, folks.